we generally don't like how we look on camera because it's not what we see. What we see is how we look in the mirror. But of course, the mirror flips your image, right? So the left is the right and the right is the left. And then of course, you're there primping away and fixing yourself up when you're in the mirror. You're not usually standing still. So you get a very distorted sense of how you look. And then of course, most of our faces are not symmetrical. So when you put that in front of a video camera, it's a little off-putting. That's not how you see yourself. But trust me, this is how other people see us. And generally, they don't run away as soon as they see you coming, as soon as they see your face. So it's all right. But you still got to get over it, or you're never going to be able to do video. So number one, control your lighting. This is super, super important. And if you're not going to use camera uh, you know, lighting, special lighting. I have that, but I'm feeling a little lazy today. So what I'm doing is what you're going to want to do, which is using natural light. But specifically, what you want to do is you want to use diffused lighting, softer lighting, and you get that on a cloudy day, on an overcast day, on a rainy day. Are you one of those people who normally is like, oh, it's raining, it's depressing, it's dull? Well, trust me. When it comes to video, you're going to be excited that it's a rainy day. What you want to do is sit your camera or your phone or, you know, your laptop so that you're facing that window. There's a window right in front of me and it's an overcast day. So all you got to do is just let that do its magic. A couple of things to remember though, and that is number one, that diffused lighting can make you look a little bit flat. You know, sort of not a lot of definition in your face in terms of shadows and highlights. So what you want to do is make sure that you pop from the background. You don't want to be standing against, you know, a pale wall, that kind of thing. You don't want to be wearing a really light pale color. You're just going to disappear. <laughs> so that's number one. And the other thing to make yourself have a little definition is to, you know, just amp up whatever makeup you've got on. So play up the eyebrows, the eyes, uh, the, the lip color, go, you know, like a, just a little notch more than you normally would. And make sure, you know, use a little powder or a little foundation so that you don't have a, you know, a shine on your face. But generally speaking, this is what you want to do. Control your lighting. You're going to be much happier to look in that lens because you're going to like what you see. <laughs> and trust me, you're going to love it when it's a rainy overcast day. 